On Triple D, we've been to every state in the country, we have been to the big cities, and we've been to the small towns. And wait till you hear this story. A husband and wife team, well actually, a husband and wife team and their kids, well actually it's a husband and wife team and their kids and his parents are serving up comfort food to the good folks of Laramie, Wyoming. This is Jay's Prairie Rose Cafe. Philly cheesesteak going down. They treat you like family here and good home cooking. And enough to feed a guy your size? Oh yeah. I got the load of hash. It's just a fixture in Laramie. And Jason and Anna Eichbush have three generations working to keep this community fed. Dad helps and mom helps on the weekends. And I have my older kids cooking. You got a whole family affair going on here. Getting sausage on the tower. How do you describe what is going on here at the Prairie Rose? Hometown diner. J7220 Burrito. The 7220 Burrito is named after the altitude of Laramie. The filling in that is hash browns, sauteed vegetables with this slightly spicy green chili. Start cooking, good looking. We're we making our pork rub for, for our pork. For, for our pork. And this is all going for the 7992 burrito. 7220. Dang. Start with our chili powder, ground cumin, and a mess of kosher salt. A mess now. Brown sugar, granulated garlic, paprika. A good amount of cayenne. Onion powder. Black pepper and dry mustard. Throw it in a little braising, what is apple cider vinegar? It's a mixture of water and liquid smoke. All right, so hit that with the dry rub. I like to go in a convection oven, about four and a half hours. What's the next step? We're gonna make our famous green chili. Start by seasoning the pork. Garlic powder and season salt. Butter in our pot. I thought butter. that was orange juice. Just a just little, a just little. a little bit so of butter. So just a touch of butter. Yeah. So we got our ground pork, diced onions. Let this cook 15, 20 minutes. Okay. When we're done making this roux, we're gonna add it. Or, which way? <laughs> which, I, I got it. <laughs> This is just water chicken stock. This is the base to the green chili. Diced tomatoes, you can't have green chili without, without green, green chili. chili. Jalapenos, garlic, cumin, chili powder, paprika, black pepper, and some seasoned salt. This will cook down, the pork and onions will cook, then we'll add the flour, make the roux, dump it in, the whole thing will be done. Yeah. And this is the chili that goes on top of the 722. 7220. 7220, son of a. By the end of this, I'll get it right. All right, let's get started. So we'll have our hash browns on the grill. This is our pork. We know it's done. When, when it, the bone comes out, comes hey, here's out. a souvenir for the kids. Pull our pork, a little butter, diced cream breakfast, diced onions, black beans. Normally we'd do an egg here, but since we're doing a guy-friendly dish. Guy-friendly. Warm our flour tortilla to make it pliable. Load that into our tortilla. Jay's Prairie Rose, known for these small portions. Absolutely. Our hash brown, cheese. And you think that that's going to roll up into a burrito? It will. And now the green chili. Cheese on top, some chives. And all right, let me finally get some counter time. That's a pretty good napkin. I got any right there, am I good? Looking good. Pork is delicious, nice and tender and juicy. The green chili, brother, that is comfort food 101. I mean, that is welcome to Larry me. Have a nice day. We'll see you tomorrow morning. Yeah, if you leave here hungry, it's your own fault. <laughs> if you leave here hungry, it's because your jaw's wide shot. Oh, <laughs> Axel. Load of 7220 up. I travel all over the world. I've never had green chili better than the green chili they have here. It's very savory and flavorful. Okay. 